What we're doing here in Vermont uh, is we're going to be selling around the country uh, sweatshirts and t-shirts and all of the money that's going to be raised, which I expect will be a couple of million dollars, will be going to programs like Meals on Wheels that feed uh, low-income senior citizens. So it turns out actually to be a, a good thing and not only a fun thing. Thing that I made in my craft room with the sewing machine my mom gave to me when I was 12 made it to the national stage and so I was just flattered. On um, Inauguration Day, when I saw that that name was trending, I said, oh, I'm going to go get that pattern. I'm going to modify it real quick to make it look like his inauguration outfit. And um, I jumped on that pretty quick. I made that in about seven hours, and then I released the pattern, and um, that's how that happened. It turns out actually to be a, a good thing and not only a fun thing. Hello, Senator. How are you, Seth? Good. You know, we last spoke right before the election, and now here we are in the uh, first full day of the Biden era. How are you feeling? I am feeling great. Uh, I, I was almost in tears. I was at the inauguration uh, yesterday, and uh, I was in tears seeing uh, the new president getting sworn in and the old president leaving Washington. Uh, you, it will not surprise you to know uh, that I was aware you were at the inauguration. <laughs> I, I heard say, about that. Yeah. Uh, I would say, you know, outside of, uh, of uh, uh, Amanda, uh, the, the inaugural poet uh, who was incredible, you were sort of one of the stars uh, of the inauguration. Were you aware uh, that this photo uh, was uh, immediately sort of became the meme of the day? Not at all. I was just sitting there trying to keep warm, trying to pay attention to what was going on. I appreciate that you're not a politician who uses memes, but uh, you became one. I mean, do you, uh, does your staff show them to you? Here you are with the, uh, the Sex and the City girls. <laughs> yeah, I've seen them. <laughs> The other what was really what... nice, Seth, is the woman who made the mittens uh, lives in Essex Junction, Vermont. She is a school teacher and is a very, very nice person. And she has been somewhat overwhelmed by the kind of attention that is being shown to her mittens. I, you know, uh, she struck me as the kind of supporter who would make uh, Bernie Sanders mittens because I read her saying that she, a lot of people have reached out asking for the mittens. And she basically said, look, I work. Uh, I'm a mother, I don't have time to make you mittens. And I thought that that is very in line with what I, uh, I uh, expect of you as well, all business. And I promise, I promise to get to a substantive discussion here. I don't want to waste all the time talking about memes. But the other question, of course, is people were asking what you were carrying. What was your uh, manila envelope? I'd love to tell you, Seth, it's top secret. <laughs> you know what, I appreciate it. I appreciate uh, uh, your honesty.